Flight VS-25 set off from Heathrow just after eight last night. An Airbus A340, similar to this, was carrying 252 passengers and 15 crew to New York's JFK airport. Around six miles west of Heathrow, at a height of 8,000 feet, the co-pilot was targeted by the laser. The flight continued for a time, but turned back near Shannon. A website says it's obtained a recording of a conversation with air traffic controllers. We have a medical issue with one of the pilots uh, after a laser incident after takeoff, and we're going to return to Heathrow. Virgin Atlantic says the decision to return to Heathrow was taken as a precaution. It says the safety of its customers and crew are its top priority. The airline has apologised to anyone who's been inconvenienced. Those affected have spent the night in nearby hotels. According to the Civil Aviation Authority, 1,440 lasers were targeted at aircraft in the UK in 2014, the first rise in three years. And last year, a pilot suffered severe eye damage from a beam when he came in to land at Heathrow. Virgin Atlantic says it's working with the Metropolitan Police and other agencies to establish who caused this latest air scare. Nick Qureshi, BBC News.